Jamia Millia Islamia is a home away from home for over 20,000 students who come from different parts of the country to become part of the plural, diverse and inclusive fabric of the university. The university imparts education starting from primary classes to doctoral and postdoctoral research in diverse academic disciplines. It also offers degree and diploma programs through distance education. Starting with a modest beginning in 1920, Jamia, a center for excellence, today has grown into nine faculties, 42 departments, 31 centers of higher learning and research, including a polytechnic, and it offers over 270 courses. Jamia remains committed to its vision and mission, that is, to be a world-class institution which embodies excellence in education and research, as also holds dear the principles of plurality and inclusion. Jamia epitomizes the nation's ideal of unity in diversity. Jamia took birth in the cradle of the freedom movement. The foundation of the university was laid in 1920 at Aligarh. Later, it moved to Karol Bagh, Delhi and subsequently to its current campus which is spread across over 239 acres. Living up to the promises of its founding fathers, the university celebrated its centenary in 2020 and it indeed has much to celebrate. This is a very nationalist university. It's not there only for education. People who started it were not, not uh, interested only in giving education or and getting a job for their students. They were trying to make them good citizens and self-reliant. Jamia was awarded Grade A by NAC in 2015 and was ranked 6th by the Ministry of Education's NIRF 2021 rankings. The academic excellence of Jamia has been recognized internationally too. It was placed at 601-800 band in the Times Higher Education's World University Rankings, 751-800 in QS World University Rankings and 438 in round university rankings. Now our aim is to become the institute of eminence in the country. We are already up to the mark there, but if something is remaining, we are, we'll try our best. That's our next aim. In order to enhance its teaching and research potential, the university has added several new departments. The latest being the departments of environmental sciences, foreign languages, hospital management and hospice studies, and design and innovations. Jamia boasts of a state-of-the-art central instrumentation facility for national researchers and an advanced characterization laboratory in the center for nanoscience and nanotechnology. The university has made significant contributions to e-content development and e-learning initiatives undertaken by the government. The AJK Mass Communication Research Center has produced over 3,000 syllabus-based e-content and video programs. It offers several MOOCs courses and has one educational satellite TV channel on the Swayam Prabha DTH platform. The academic curriculum at Jamia offers a strong theoretical foundation together with practical skills and is in tune with the needs of the society. The courses are revised regularly with emphasis on skill and ability enhancement which is in tune with the National Education Policy 2020. The university lays emphasis on research and development. Jamia has an H index of 129. 
with over 1,100 papers annually in Scopus indexed publications. Over 400 books and book chapters are published every year by faculty members of the university. Uh, my university will also give enough um, uh, funding to the teacher to do research. We can get the funds from the government or from any other source that we have to find and also to uh, publish their researches in good journals. That brings honor to the university. The university campus has 100% Wi-Fi connectivity and the ICT is fully integrated in academic and administrative processes at the university. It has moved several of its activities online including admissions, examinations, administration which has improved efficiency and transparency in the system. Jamia has created a safe campus for all stakeholders by placing a robust surveillance system comprising over 400 CCTV cameras. The Dr. Zakir Hussain Central Library offers scholars access to large amount of research and data with both in-campus and remote access options. It offers online catalog, digital repository and digital resource center. The university has international students from over 30 countries and has signed agreements and MOUs with over 50 overseas universities and institutions. Jamia has completed over two dozen GAN programs and has secured several SPARK projects. The university encourages students to participate in a range of co-curricular and extracurricular activities. NCC NSS Sports Gym facilities and several fun clubs are on offer to students aiding their overall growth. Jamia has contributed to the world of sports by nurturing several national and international sporting icons. मुझे जितना प्यार और इज्जत जामिया से मिली है उसको मैं हमेशा अपने जीवन के सुनहरे पलों में गिनता रहूंगा हॉकी में तो मैं कह सकता हूं कि जामिया का एक बहुत बड़ा योगदान रहा है जिस तरह से आपने ये चीज स्पोर्ट्स को बेसिकली संभाला है ऐसे ही आगे आने वाले सालों में आप स्पोर्ट्स को एक स्टेप ऊपर ले जाएं बिसाइड्स जामिया हैज प्रोड्यूस्ड सेवरल फिल्म स्टार्स पॉलिसी मेकर्स लेजिस्लेटर्स ब्यूरोक्रेट्स scientists, media personalities, among others. The university also runs several cafeterias on campus, one of which is run by an all-women's group, bringing about community development and women's empowerment. Besides imparting training in healthcare, the MA Ansari Health Center, the Center for Physiotherapy and the Faculty of Dentistry also cater to the medical needs of students faculty, staff and those in the neighborhood. The MA Ansari Health Center has played a crucial role during the second wave of the pandemic where it has reserved beds and other emergency facilities including oxygen cylinders and oxygen concentrators for the COVID-19 patients. The training and placement office of the university helps in the placement of students by arranging regular interactions with industries and entrepreneurs. We are reaching out to the industry. We are uh, inviting them to come and help us in making our curriculum. So uh, the cu curriculum is ready for the job that they, they, are, uh, they want to give to our students. And that makes a lot of difference. That's why the placement is being done by the same industry who came in the beginning to improve our course. True to its mandate, the university has a strong outreach program with several initiatives such as Nai Manzil, Center for Early Childhood Development, Social Exclusion and Inclusion of Women's Studies being some. Jamia also runs a residential coaching academy for those aspiring to be civil servants and has produced 246 civil servants through UPSC, 
and 376 in other central, state and allied services since its inception in 2010. To nurture the rich culture and history of the nation, the Prem Chand Archives and the MF Hussein Art Gallery maintain both permanent displays and temporary exhibits. During the COVID-19 pandemic, Jamia organized several faculty development programs on online teaching tools and techniques for teachers across the country. Many programs towards e-learning and MOOCs development, ARPIT, faculty induction programs and students counseling too were conducted. Being a partially residential university, Jamia provides a safe and friendly environment to students, including girls, and offers a sociable atmosphere. During my master's program, I could, I could say that all through the long journey of as an independent scientist that I have had, uh, the foundation was laid during my master's. In fact, due to my uh, association with Jamia, I got inspiration to work as a scientist. I am really proud to be counted amongst the alumni of this dynamic university. It's like so nice, it's like bana diya. So thank you so much, Jamia. The image of Jamia we see, that is like a melting pot of cultures. Jamia made history with Professor Najma Akhtar being appointed its first woman vice chancellor in 100 years. She is playing a significant role towards the implementation of the National Education Policy 2020. She has also brought sustainable development goals to the center stages. The university promotes gender equity. Several women are holding statutory positions in the institution. We have one of the highest ranking uh, and highest quality of education but the lowest fees so that the people who come here are not coming from very rich families but when they go out they are going to be able to look after their family after their country jamia is poised to take a leadership role in the domain of education in the 21st century it is aspiring to get counted among the top universities of the world and contribute to the task of nation building as envisaged by the founding fathers of the institution. Shahri haar, zoom,